What you like about working at the radio? Working on the radio, work, you know, having a show. I say, I'm going to just tell people this, like, Orlando don't really respect the radio, if you catch what I'm saying. Like, Atlanta, that shit hold weight. That's like having a black card. Here, it's cool, you get what I'm saying? But, like, my face card was valid before I went to the radio station. Right. So it ain't really, you got that. it ain't really do too much for me. But when I go to other cities and they hear I'm on the radio, oh, boy, they hold demeanor change. Why you think Orlando don't value the radio like that? Damn. I feel like before they like beforehand they was behind on time. You get what I'm saying? Cause it's been plenty of times where like pre-COVID, me and Africa Black would go up to the station and then they have meet and greets with an artist. Bro, we already we've been running your shit for a whole year. Already. Right. We in the we in the meeting. Hey bro, we played your song at this part. This shit went crazy. And then that's how we got a lot of our relationships already. So I just feel like they was behind you know, they be behind on time and stuff like that. But they don't really understand the the business of it. You get what I'm saying? Just because mm -hmm. the song come out on Friday doesn't mean it's going to come out on the radio on Friday. Like, that shit got to pick up traction. The label got to be like, okay, we're going to put ads on it. All right, cool. They might pay for Orlando, Atlanta, Tampa. You know, they might pay for five cities just to see what it do. And then once it does great in them cities, then it goes up on a bigger scale, a national scale. If you catch what I'm saying. Right, right. You say we you say we don't um Orlando don't really respect the radio, but I see one or two jams came back and that's like, a classic the, though. The, the city kind of uh Yeah, the city turned the about city, that. City happy you about get what that. I'm saying? I'm saying how, how do you feel about that being that I don't know if y'all consider them a competitor or you know what I'm saying, like you say it's a, it's, Man, it's, it's, a classic it's it's bro, it's it's a respect, boy. <laughs> I, I I remember growing up listening to 102 Jams, listening to J Love. So J Love, yes, you know, sir. even if I ever get that, if I, you know, God willing, if I get that phone call, man, I'm there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, yeah, J Love. I, that, as soon as they said that came back, that's the first name I thought about. J Love. Facts, 